Hello, I'm a little bit shocked by Mick Lynch. Um, I'm not shocked that uh, there is a strike. People who are working need to be paid properly and treated fairly. I am shocked that Mike, Mick Lynch, Lynch should now be saying that disruption will be minimal. Because whatever Mick Lynch intends, <clears throat> the train companies are going to make this as ghastly as possible. It's already ghastly. I am among many, I'm sure, who cannot possibly use trains to go home for Christmas and get back. I have to be um, back performing on Boxing Day. There are no trains. So either I spend a huge amount on taxes or I don't travel. And I'm sure I'm not alone. I'm sure I'm not alone. So for Mick Lynch to um, use words to suggest that disruption is minimal is disingenuous. It's, uh, it's wrong, it's false. Disruption is huge. And whether he intends it or not, disruption will be huge. And that should focus our mind on the question about whether or not the um, opportunities from Brexit, which I've never heard um, defined since Brexit, are worth it. A lot of this comes down to Brexit, comes down to investment by the rail companies, comes down to whether or not this um, COD privatisation, where bits of the rail company are private and bits of the rail company are effectively nationalised or held by another larger company, uh, it, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. And it's not about safety. Well, it is about safety. But it's primarily about a system which is in disarray. And the system is in disarray because bureaucracy has overtaken productivity and delivery and service. And we see that across the country. Bureaucracy has overtaken the job which is supposed to be done. And people, rather than taking responsibility for what they are doing, for paying the people who are working, for doing the jobs, are more inclined to mess around with bits of paper. It's back, really, to the old um, deceit, which was mendacious in itself, the checks in the post. It's simply wrong, and we have a world which is run on computers and run on efficiency. To use that language and to distort language to mean something that we're not doing. Mick Lynch in this situation is wrong. I know what he's trying to do. He's trying to recapture the moral high ground. He's got the moral high ground. He doesn't need to recapture it. He just needs to tell us the truth. Disruption, even if it doesn't, even if the strikes don't take place, disruption will happen. We saw that a couple of weeks ago. Even when the strikes didn't take place, disruption was all over the network. Why? Because the network is running um, is, is running on a, on, on a shoestring because the investment is in the wrong places. A little bit like the NHS. The investment is in the bureaucrats, not the people who do the jobs. It is wrong, 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 wrong.